to observe the letters for which we are getting the double values c r t r d n d what you can understand here is for all the consonants for all the consonants we are getting the double values and the letters we left are exactly vowels for consonants the logic was getting double and coming to vowels let's see what is the logic and what are the vowels a e i o u now let's see what happened for e i am having i for e we are having i for a we are having e next for e again i same and here for o we are having u for o we are having u for u we are having a for u we are having a so from this what we can understand is for consonants we are taking the double values and for vowels we are writing the next vowel as the code letter simply see we are taking next letter every time u next it is again a so we are taking the next letter now according to that logic we can write g value 7 double because it is a consonant so double that is 14 14 is nothing but n r value 18 and it is a consonant so that we are getting double 36 means j it is a vowel for vowel next letter e next it should be i a it is also a vowel so a next it should be a so t is a consonant so 20 double 40 40 means n in this way you can answer the required word so this is how you need to understand the given logic so when you understand you can solve easily So till now whatever we discuss everything is related to the value of each and every alphabet. Suppose let me take one more. So the same kind like if book is coded as J M L X what is the code for pen here also 2 15 15 11 10 13 12 24 now what you can understand here is simply when you observe this you will get the required logic now let's see what is the required logic now minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 minus 4 actually b value 2 if i take the other value 28 28 minus 4 is uh, 24 so in this way you can understand so we are subtracting but in reverse order so we are writing in reverse order now we should consider here n minus 1 which is m e minus 2 which is c p minus 3 which is m so in this way we can understand the logic in this case so which is the same as the given word so like this these are the codings related to the value of each and every alphabet unlike this sometimes the coding technique is depending upon the position of the letters now let's see how we can depend upon the position of the letters suppose india is coded as a i d n i 
what is the code for nation so from this what we can understand is the word india is replaced by the code a i d n i so here what we can understand is we are writing the alphabets in the reverse order so simply here we need to write the letters in the reverse order first n then o then i then t then a then n so simply we are writing in the reverse order so that is the code so in this way we can expect the answer depending upon the logic involved so here wh what we are doing simply we are taking the given words and understanding the logic and writing in the same manner so this is one logic where we are depending upon the position of the letters suppose sometimes mother is given as r m e o h t then the code for teacher we want for teacher if mother is coded as r m e o h t now what is the code for teacher now let's see so how i am writing the code for the word mother the logic is very simple r and then m then e then o then h then t so from the given word we are writing the letters in which way we are taking the last letter as the first one and then we are coming and taking the first as the next again going back and taking the last but one in the next position now the second letter so last first last first is the logic what we are following in the same way we can write this word in the form of first r next t next e next e next h next a and then c so first last first last first last is the logic so r t e e h a c so in that way we can understand the required answer easily let's take the next one suppose if college is coded as l o c l e g e then what is the code for student so the word college is coded as l o c l e g e then what is the code for student so from this what we can understand is the middle letter is at the same position and the first part l o c is written c o l is written as l o c and the last part is also writing in the reverse order but fortunately we are getting the same because e g e will become e g e now in the same way how we can write this word is uh, the middle letter should be at the same position the first part should be replaced by u t s and the second part will become t n e so what we are doing is keeping the middle letter at the same position and writing the first part in reverse order at the same time second part in the reverse order so this is how we are writing in this case now let us take another one if school is written as c s o h l o now 
what is the code for father so when you look at this what you can understand is the first two letters of the given word were reverse and then i'm taking the next two letters and taking the reverse and the last two i'm writing in the reverse order so every time we are taking two two letters and writing them in reverse order so according to the same logic first we should take the first two letters and writing in the reverse order so fa will become af next two letters will be written as ht next er should be written as re this is the code for father so whatever the logic they are giving we should follow the same thing whether it is writing in the reverse order whether it is taking by two two letters whether it is having the first part and the last part excluding the middle letter so whatever they are giving we should write in the same way so like this sometimes it is related to the position of the letters so where we are depending upon the position so how you can identify this is when you look at the given word and its code suppose if you take school s c h o o l or the alphabets in this word now just check the given code c s o h l o so here the letters in these two terms are same whether you take the given word or its code those two are same so you can understand that and you can go for the position related logic in the previous case whatever the examples we discussed in those cases the letters in the given word are not same as the letters in the code so from that difference you can understand whether it is related to the position or it is related to the alphabet value if they are concentrating on the value definitely the letters what we are getting will be different sometimes we may get the same letters only for few letters but most of the times it will be different value but in this case the letters are same but we are replacing them in different orders so like that related to the order or related to the value we can expect sometimes every time we are writing the code only sometime so here they will ask in reverse suppose if the same thing is given school is uh, coded as c s o h l o now they will ask a question like by giving the code we should write the right word suppose if they ask which word is coded as which word is coded as o s i c l a unlike the previous one now it is the code given and we need to decode that in the previous cases the word is given we need to find the required code but in this case the code itself given and we want that word now here the logic is very simple so taking two two letters and writing in reverse order now when they are doing that process they got this particular code now we want the right word for this now simply we should decode that by depending upon the logic now after taking the first two letters and writing in the reverse order we got o s definitely before that it is s o and i c after taking the reverse so c i now l a is nothing but a l so in this way we can find the required word when the code is given so instead of asking the code sometimes they will mention the code and we need to find out the required words in this way in both the ways we are doing the same here we need to decode in the previous case we need to code so here reverse process will be followed next sometimes there will be a code like if good is coded as 16 
bad is coded as 9. What is the code for great? Now, good is coded as 16, bad is coded as 9. What is the code for great? So now, if you understand this, there are four letters, that's why it is taken as four square. And here, three letters, that's why three square. And here, five letters, so five square should be the answer. We can consider it as a 25. So in this way, depending upon the number of letters, we can find out. And some other times, the code will be given as The word computer is coded as The word computer is coded as C O M P U T E R. That means how I am writing? Simply, we are writing the same letters but taking the consonants and writing in lower case and keeping the vowels in upper case. In the same way, now they will ask what is the code for mobile? Now, mobile so m is a consonant lower case o is a vowel and b and i l e so in this way uh, we can write so they will mention one particular logic we should follow the same thing If nu is coded as 14523, what is the code for today? So the word nu is coded as 14523. Here you can understand one thing. If I add the values, definitely I, I won't be getting 14523. So I am not adding the value of these letters. Then what is the other way where I will get the answer as 14523? If you look at these alphabet values, it is 14, it is 5, it is 23. So they are writing all these values continuously to make the code. So from that you can understand here T value 20. So first we should write 20 and then O value 15. That's why we are writing 1, 5. D value 4 means we should replace 4 and 1 and then y25 so 25 the code for today will become 20154125 so in this way uh, we can find the required code for this word so the logic is very simple writing its values simply where we will get the required answer